Warwick Kepper's in the house. And boom, boom there, Michael. <laughs> yup, your tea. How are you, bro? How's the uh, living legend, the human headline? Good, mate. Had a good week and up to um, Australia Day, up to Chuka. Did a bit of barefooting. Almost tore my hamstring. That was undifferent. Amazing. Saw Lisa Carrie Kenny, mm. my partner on um, the old uh, Celebrity Apprentice. It's pretty couple, hot. A couple of years ago with Max. On the weekend. Yeah, with Maxi, Maxi Bonds and... Uh, Lisa Carrie Kenny, it was good. Did you get around in your speedos like you used to? Oh, I was in the 44. 80s? Speedos or board shorts? Uh, board shorts. I was sweating more than Gypsy the mortgage up there. Jeez, it was hot. A bit hot, man. Nightmare. It? But it's a good thing's happening on 7 this week at Sunrise, and we've got the, um, the new song I'm going to sing on Kiss FM. Oh. Called Telephone Number. Oh, you've got that one coming out. So I'm going to sing it on the show next week. Mm. Well, I enjoy these weekly shows because I, I, I don't see you as much. You've got all these. Uh, you know, you're all over Melbourne and... Uh, also got, we've also got 60 shops opening this week. Terrific. Kappa's Big and Tasty Food Diners. with a, yeah. Not Jaffles, they're called Raffles. And, Healthy. And I hear rumours you're going to um, join a male strip team called Aussie Heat. Become if, a male stripper. If you can't have the heat, get out of the kitchen, Warwick. <laughs> I was in Penthouse three times. Actually, once, but it took up three pages. If he can afford me, 5G <laughs> appearance, I'm there. Put the old G-string backwards, make you jump higher. Like in the 80s, on, you know, the tall with tight shorts. Yeah. I wore that backwards. Made me jump higher. I love that song, the 80s. That film quote, very much like Duran Duran. And remember what we've got in common? I only it take says, what's mine. Duran Duran and Kylie yep. Minogue. Let's go and have a look at a clip. What you've been up to? Warwick's World. Let's have some fun. Nearly a high floater. Grant Laurie and Kappa. Kappa! Oh, one of the marks of the year. Now, Kappa, a big chance here on Langford. Oh, dear. Oh, what a mark. Some of your interesting roles since your post football days stripper, meter maid, porn star, male escort, comedian, singer, lollipop man, an all round movie star. And that's the kind of resume you'd want a reality star to have. Completely unique and special. Wacky Warwick, he's one in a million, and Warwick's world is going to be hilarious. <laughs> For the first time in Australian Big Brother history, a housemate was evicted by Big Brother. Despite the late hour, most of the house is still up and having a joke at the expense of Warwick, who's gone to bed and is trying to sleep. problem with Warwick and he just dropped his uh, pants and uh, flashed Sarah Marie and I his penis. That is just, that's just not even funny. It is, it's, I can't, I'm laughing because I can't believe he did it. I'm not laughing. Can't I can't believe, he, I can't believe he thinks that flat amusing. A man in the Big Brother house just flashed his <laughs> 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 Another guest standing by, volunteering their services. Hello, Sydney! <laughs> Great to be here, mate. Hell of a run. But I made it. <laughs> Yay! I'm not going to ask you a question. Is he still there? Fire and ready, buddy. <laughs> there has got to be someone else. Anyone. <laughs> Were they your son's shorts? No, he wasn't born then, you dummy. Why did you wear such... For marketability. I can't spell that, but marketability. <laughs> I went to school once. I went to school once when I came back to the hospital. You turned 50 this year. What's it been like with a slow transition from a stupid young man to a stupid old man? <laughs> That's a bit fast for an ugly man like yourself with no hair. Calling me stupid. I can't believe that, you fool. I look 37, you look 70. You must say I look old. You idiot. Now, last question. What are your views on Syria? What do you mean Syria? That's the place of it. Yeah. What do you mean Syria? The, yeah. The, the war place. The wartime place? Yes. Maybe the best place for a footy fit. <laughs> okay. 
interesting insight. Thank you very much for it. Morning, Ask Eagle. Big Bill where the milk is. Where's the milk, Big Bill? This is Big some, Bill. Some toast here. Gary, the milkman has arrived. Three Please welcome no, it's not. to no, the it's Big not. Bill house. What? The Wiz, Warwick, Kappa! <laughs> the Wiz! <laughs> it was Kappa. He is a Sydney. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> well, Bill, it was worry, Kappa! You f***ing <laughs> beauty! What have you done to your face? Just had a little touch-up. You have, haven't you? Bit of brown rouge. I'm a bit like Sam. I've had that much plastic surgery when I cry. Yeah. The tears run down my back. <laughs> <laughs> well, you going to do an hour of this? Some people say I've got tickets to myself. Let's say the concert is sold out. Hey. <laughs> Very, very sharp. With an IQ of three, but he can leap like a flea. Wire a kappa. He loved himself. He didn't crack an entry to the <laughs> marvelous century. That was Warwick. Take a kappa on him. He up. loved himself. Yeah, yeah. Kappa! According to Warwick Kappa, the only thing missing on Australian TV is, well, Warwick Kappa. So for all those television execs wanting to sign him up, here's a taste of what you would get. Welcome to Warwick Kappa's world, a world unlike any other. Now Warwick wants to turn his wacky world into a television show. Mike Wiggins? Yeah. How's nice me here looking? Andrew? Yeah, we're here with Warwick's world, not Warwick Kappa, in case you've been living on Mars. This latest shot to have a TV show all about him is all thanks to his short but memorable turn on Celebrity Apprentice. Come on, Kappa! my time and this is the perfect time for Warwick's work. He'll apparently always be a superstar, just ask him. Because oh, I got the charisma and I was before my time. You do love yourself and I don't mean that in a rude way but you do. Why wouldn't I? I'm sexy and I know it. Warwick Kappa, you're a superstar with charisma they say. Well if you've got to find it mate, I was on a current affair, footy show, sunrise. Back on the footy show, in two, back on the footy show in two weeks, Rove, he was good. Amazing. I made Rove famous like yourself. What I was going to ask you, Kappa, that, that diary room and with Big Brother, you know, yeah. when, uh, when they're talking about the member, your member. Yeah, that was a bit of fun. Did you get told off? Did you sort of a bit of counselling or...? Yeah, they said, Warwick, how big's your penis? I said, three inches from the ground. <laughs> they said, Warwick, get to the diary room. You need some counselling. Because I went nude. I, was, I went nude. I lasted two nights. Had a 10-day contract. After you get told off by Big Brother, do you actually meet Big Brother? Does some dude come out and say... Yeah, there's three, there's three different ones. Is there? And one's a girl, one's a ring-in. And are they a bit more authentic and kind once they tell you off yeah. behind the scenes? They said they wanted me to stay on, but they wanted to kick me out for their ratings. Three, three and a half million people watched it. And can I ask you one question? What's uh, the Harbour Bridge, VB? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the Harbour Bridge? What does that mean to you? Oh, I always liked Sydney because I was, went up there as a, as a pioneer in 83. And we're only getting 5,000 a game. After I was there for a year and a half, we ended up getting about 28 to 30,000 average crowds. So Dr. Ellison came in, bought us a pink Lamborghini, helicopters, had Swanettes, had a spa with the Swanettes, Freedom of Leanne Ellison, and we had a bit of a circus at half time. So we got Warwick. the crowds in and it worked. Warwick's world. People love you, mate. Thanks for coming on. You better go and get some more exciting action. We are. Shake we'll, my see hand, bro. we'll see you in LA soon. Love and Bali. Best... Oh, well, we're going to LA. Love yeah. and best wishes, bro. Thanks, mate. Don't forget to call Warwick Kappa, Warwick's World. He'll be joining us every week with some uh, crazy and fun excitement. Coming up very shortly, a world class stripper on the couch. The girls will love this oh, one. You'll be Darren Sutton from Aussie Heat. We love Don't Darren. go away. We like Darren.